Hey everybody, here it is, uh, Sunday, quarter after eight. Dog got me up early again, so just gonna, gonna go back at the cart, see if we can get her finished up, so I'll break back in here again um, when I get her all rest away roughed in. So, yeah, it's raining out again, so guess this is the best place to be. So, I'll be right back. Hey YouTubers, it's now 5 to 10 and I'm about as far as I can go on the cart. Um, the top on, don't like the top, so I just tacked it on for now. I'm going to see if I can get a piece of quarter inch steel. Uh, just want to give it a shot of her before I give her a paint job. Little handle, uh, kept it down low so that it didn't catch on things when uh, I overhang. So there's a little shaft I put out here to show you what my idea was on that. Get a glove because it's still hot. Uh, that's a piece of solid. I don't know, two and a half, maybe just a second. It is two inch, two and an eighth. Yeah, two and an eighth. Solid shaft. Uh, it'll stay in there. I'm not using it. Might have to cut a little bit off. It just uh, probably be all right. Um, pull her out. Uh, put a couple little locking nuts on here, so it just locks her down when I'm not using it, or when I am using it, and. Uh, So, should work out all right. Uh, sometimes you want to bend a piece of steel. Just uh, beat her on that. So, um, she is a hefty cart. Um, reason being, I plan on pounding on it. It's going to be a welding table. It's going to be a vice table. Uh, it's going to be holding my welders. Um, I am going to put doors on it, I'll open them when I'm using the welder so they don't get hot, so let's mirror through. Uh, the ideal thing is, is, if I need it on one side of the vehicle, I'll just drag it around. Uh, moves pretty easy, never greased her yet. I'll wait till I, uh, wait till I uh, get her all painted, so. Anyways, just want to give you a quick shot. It's, uh, like I said, it's all scrap steel. Uh, don't know about the wheels. Uh, they're like five, six bucks at Prince's Auto. I I think they're going to be all right, but if they're not, I'll get a get some with some better bearings in them or something. So, anyways, I'll uh, like I said, don't look like much, is it? But uh, you'd be surprised what a well. We all probably all know this, but it'd look a lot better once it's painted. Um, and like I said, it'll scoot over there in that corner over there, the other way, I'm not using it. And get the little mig off the floor, and that off the wall. Uh, big accomplishment. And uh, get my vice on it. I don't know exactly where I'm going to mount that yet, but uh, like I said, I don't like the tops too thin. It uh, buckles, and I say it's only about eighth of an inch, so. I'll see if I can get a piece of uh, quarter inch steel, uh, two feet wide, four feet long. That'll give me a good, good solid top. So, anyways, I'll break back in. And she's painted. So, ready right back. Well, well, here we are back. Um, it's 25 to one now, and I've been done for about an hour now. I. Uh, Gave the cart paint job, cleaned up the garage, took out the scrap, put dope back for the next project. So, uh, I was going to go look at that car today, but I don't think I got a lawn that needs mowed and garden to put in. And it's threatening the rain, so I was thundering here a while ago, but stopped now. So, uh, I'm going to wrap this up and uh, call it a day in here and go do some other stuff.
So I'll give you a little shot of the car with the paint job on her. Like I said, I gotta get uh, some metal for the sides, um, for the doors. Uh, still wet. But I just give it a quickie. I'll uh, give it another coat when I get the doors on it and uh, make her look a little better. It was a pain in the butt to paint those at screening, but it was done. Say, just a quick, simple curt. I am going to replace the top with something heavier. Um, I want it heavy enough that I can beat on it if I have to. Don't want it to break, bend, or whatever. Nice to have a nice level top. And that stuff there was just too thin plus the only piece I had had a it was the overlap on the side of the oil barrel so I ended up with the seam going down through there so but for now that'll do See, there's my little anvil we'll call it for uh, making curves in metal quick curves so anyway so that'll It'll fit nicely over there in that corner right there. And uh, I'll probably put some bolts in the wall so that I can hook it on there and make it stable if I need it stable. and Just make a quick release on it. So I think I'll end up using this and quite a lot. So and that's better than a wooden table. It won't catch on fire. So I'm always worried about fire out here. So anyways, uh, just a quick update. On today's, it doesn't look like it got much accomplished, but actually it was a big accomplishment to get some of this heavy stuff out of the way. And I think through the week, this week, I'll come out for half an hour or so a night and start uh, organizing stuff. I got a lot of stuff in boxes, and I'll start putting it in the shelves in the cabinet. And uh, I want to finish. I want to finish over there too. Uh, over there in the little cubby hole for the. We're going to mix the paint. I, uh, I'm thinking about putting ceramic tile on the bottom and maybe up the back because that way it'll stay clean, be easy to wipe down. And I don't think the chemicals will hurt it all that much. So, and I have a door that I'm going to put on there, and I have a couple hood shocks off an old car I saved one time. Uh, I'm going to put that on the doors so the, I can lift the door up and it'll stay up. So that should work out already. Uh, it's always nice not to have to buy stuff, just uh, build it yourself. So uh, that's what I do. It's, like I said, it's nothing fancy, but it'll do the job. And uh, keep this place cleaned up. And uh, once I get everything painted in here, I'm going to put some weather stripping and stuff around those doors on the cabinet uh, so that when I uh, put handles and stuff on them and latches when I shut them they'll be they'll be sealed so I don't want dust and stuff getting in there so that's the idea there and uh, shouldn't take much longer before I'm ready to paint uh, my young fellow brought me up a construction sign yesterday. I'll put that on the wall somewhere. Just give me a second. Yeah. Uh, I First sign for the wall. Uh, actually, brought me two, so I'm gonna put that up somewhere. I'm not sure where yet. Um, might temporarily build a box around that fan and use that for cover. It might work all right. So, and the other one, he brought me two. The other one's not as good a shape, so I'll uh, 
I just think about painting something on it, play with it, maybe do a little flaming on it, try that, never did that before, but I'd like to try it, maybe get some, I don't know, some pearls or something and try some different stuff on with the paint just to play with and, and uh, do the sign up and put a lot of clear on it and I could practice on it uh, standing and buffing and try that too. So. Kill a bunch of birds with one stone. Anyways, uh, as soon as I get a chance to go see that old car, I'm gonna make a video on that. Uh, I was doing, like I said, I was gonna do it today, but I think I'll uh, stay here and do some yard work. Because if I don't do it, it'll be really high by next week and uh, four more days and I'm out of here. So, and uh, I'll get back out here and get this finished up. So. Getting closer. Takes a long time. Especially when you stick a job in between now and again, but oh well. It's gone. Closer now than it was two weeks ago, so. Anyways, uh um just sitting back having uh it's not the Cardesian rum, it's uh, just Pepsi. So I don't drink much, so I'm usually too busy out here, so uh yeah, uh, my granddaughters, I got two granddaughters and they watch my videos, so um, actually one one just left and uh, she actually made a video for me yesterday, she sang me a couple songs, stuff that was pretty neat, and uh, the other one was up yesterday, she's, uh, she's almost three, and, and uh, I had them for a drive around the yard on the golf cart, they love it. I'm not so sure I want to get rid of it, just for that reason. They just love going on that thing, so. Anyways, I want to say hi to Kendra, and I want to say hi to Savannah. Anyways, uh, they'll, they'll be watching, they always watch my videos. That's why I gotta watch my tongue. Uh, don't want them repeating some bad words, so. Not yet, anyways, I'm sure they'll pick it up as time goes by, but. Anyways, uh, they're cute little girls, so. And uh, they're a lot of fun. Anyways, it's uh, the weekend's over, and I guess I'm going to shut her down, and I will get back to you next Friday. Uh, don't know what I'll be doing for sure, but if there's nothing to do, uh, no jobs to do, I'll uh, continue on in here, and she's getting closer all the time, so thanks for watch my videos and all the comments and I enjoy all, I enjoy the comments actually uh, they're really good so anyways uh, you guys take care hope you all have a good week and we'll talk to you later bye